I'm gonna get some of that. Pretty excited, it's a nice little turd. There we go. We've got 27 samples so far, which has far exceeded anybody's expectations. And uh, pretty excited. We are here in Mongolia in the northernmost part of the country in a place called the Darhad Valley. And we're here to learn about wolverines, to gather scat and DNA evidence so we can learn about their similarities to North American populations, so that we can learn about their habits and really gain any information we can from this incredible species that we just don't know anything about. This is a scat sample of a wolverine, and it's a great scat. Tons of hair in there and bone, but the really confounding thing is this, you probably can't see it, this red blob in here that was attached to the scat. I mean, we're just left to speculate on what that is. We've got Jason with us, who is a world-renowned wolverine ecologist. Rebecca, who is our Mongolia wolverine expert. We've got Forrest with us, who is an adventure extraordinaire. And we've got Jim with us, who's uh, capturing the images for this trip in a great way. There's wolverines here. Wolverine where? There's wolverine in Mongolia? There's wolverine in Mongolia. You know, I think, I think the hard part is that, that it's a climate that we haven't been into before. I think it's going to be cold. I think it's gonna be, it could be real cold even. I, I got like a little snot metronome. It helps me keep time when I'm breaking trail. So he's just come over. Pretty windy pass. Pretty damn cold. I'd guess with the wind chill, it was about negative, oh, I don't know, maybe about zero. I uh, got a couple miles before we get out of this wind and cold. Uh, the group's ahead of me. I can barely see them through the white. I can't really tell where the sky and the ground meet. Yeah, pretty wild. We weren't, what, a mile up the valley when this train of horses appears and it's the very first animals from this migration of people moving into Darhad Valley for the summertime. Since yesterday afternoon we've seen what probably past a thousand stock animals or they've passed us. It's more accurate. So we've been doing like the salmon upstream thing following this trail as camels, oxen, sheep, goats, um, people riding horses carrying calves in their lap. Uh, it's a bit of a trip. I've never seen animals carry animals. We've come, oh, somewhere over 300 miles. Collected uh, 29 wolverine samples. Seen 25 or so tracks. We've done what everybody is feeling like was an amazing job of documenting the natural history of this range. And we get to finish on Holy cow, what a spectacular day. Thanks for playing. Thanks for being part of it.